Hello humans, this is a quiet Dr. Kai who's filming actually at 3 o'clock in the morning and his wife is asleep but I've got something so cool I just can't wait I want to get this out there as soon as possible so bear with me This is video footage of me playing Skyrim in the Oculus Rift and you can't quite see but basically to me in the Oculus Rift I've got this running as if it were a made for VR game it is stunning, the resolution is perfect, the tracking is perfect, the scale is perfect, everything and I want to show you guys how to do that in this guide. Just a fair warning, you're going to need a very good CPU and a pretty good GPU. I'd say an i7 CPU, 6th generation or above if you really want to get it running smoothly. Now the first thing you're going to need is Vorpex, so head on over to vorpex.com and then hit buy now and purchase it and install it. This is designed for the Oculus Rift but it's also being developed for the Vive as we speak. So start Vorpex running, right click on the taskbar icon, click configure Vorpex and then go into the game settings optimizer, find Elder Scrolls V Skyrim and then make sure everything is ticked including apply resolution and then click optimize settings and apply and close. Now you want to launch Skyrim however you normally launch it, I do it through the Nexus mod manager um, and then you adjust all the settings so make sure the resolution is set to 1280 by 1024, which it really should be. And then you go to advance, I'd say turn the shadows down to low for testing, and make sure there's no anti-aliasing. And then you're good to go, click play. Um, just remember you can't launch Skyrim with a script extender, that is the SKSE. It has to actually be Skyrim itself, which will then make the game load up in Oculus Rift. So put that on, I'm now filming with my phone. Now basically what you want to do is when you're in the game, Press Dell to bring up the Vorpex menu, hit direct VR detect, and it will go through this. And when that is done, things should already be a lot better, but that's not the key. Now press Dell again and bring up this menu. And the first thing you want to do is set the separation 3D strength. Um, stand near an NPC and adjust that to make sure he's about the right size. Then go to the next page. You can fiddle with the HUD scale. That basically shrinks the HUD to bring it into your field of view, that's quite important. Um, the scale itself makes it bigger or smaller and the horizontal scale makes it squashed um, but the most important step now is to set the internal resolution upscale to 2.0 and then click OK and save at the bottom and you need to restart the game and that's it, welcome to Skyrim you are now in 100% VR ready Skyrim you're there, you're finally immersed in that beautiful stunning world that you've always wanted to be you may have noticed that it was a bit blocky before, but now the resolution is perfect. So that upscale basically changed it to double the resolution, and it's beautiful. So, welcome. I hope you have a great stay. And if you're new to my channel, may I tempt you to consider subscribing? Have a look at some of my other videos, including my other VR videos. But either way, I hope I've been of help, and so long, humans. <laughs> to see what secrets they hold. Join me as I sail amongst the stars.